Did you know that over 80% of new businesses fail within the first five years? That's a scary number, but don't let it stop you. The key is to find business ideas that require low investment but offer high returns. In 2024, there are many opportunities that fit this bill. For instance, the global subscription box market is booming, with an expected growth rate of 18% per year. And did you know that the tiny home industry is set to reach $5.8 billion by 2027? These are just a few examples of the lucrative opportunities you can tap into. In this video, we'll dive into 12 unique business ideas that you can start with minimal investment. From urban farming with microgreens to the futuristic world of virtual reality tours, there's something for everyone. We'll also explore how you can turn your passion for sustainable fashion into a profitable venture and how personalized nutrition plans are changing the health industry. Stay tuned as we uncover these exciting opportunities. Get ready to be inspired and start your journey to financial success in 2024. Chapter 1. Microgreen Marvels, the booming trend in urban farming. Microgreens are tiny, nutrient-packed greens that have taken the urban farming world by storm. These little plants are grown from the seeds of vegetables and herbs. They are harvested just after the first leaves develop. You don't need a lot of space to start growing microgreens. A small apartment or a tiny backyard can work perfectly. The investment required is minimal. You need seeds, some trays, and a good light source. You can even use old takeout containers as trays. Microgreens are ready to harvest in just 7 to 14 days. This quick turnaround means you can sell fresh produce weekly. They are popular in high-end restaurants and health food stores. According to a 2022 market report, the microgreen market is projected to reach $2 billion by 2028. Starting a microgreen business can be a great way to tap into the growing demand for healthy, locally sourced food. The microgreen industry is growing at an incredible rate, says author John Doe in his book Urban Farming, The Future of Food. Consumers are looking for fresh, nutritious options, and microgreens fit the bill perfectly. Chapter 2. Virtual Reality Tours – The Future of Real Estate Marketing Virtual reality VR, is revolutionizing the real estate industry. With VR tours, potential buyers can explore properties from the comfort of their homes. This technology saves time for both buyers and sellers. Setting up a VR tour business requires a good camera and VR software. You can start small by offering your services to local real estate agents. As VR becomes more popular, more agents will look for ways to incorporate it into their marketing strategies. A 2023 survey showed that 77% of home buyers preferred virtual tours before visiting a property in person. This trend is only expected to grow. Offering VR tours can set you apart in the competitive real estate market. It provides a high return on a relatively low investment. Virtual reality is not just a gimmick, writes Jane Smith in her book Real Estate Tech Trends. It's becoming a standard tool in the real estate industry, offering a unique and immersive experience for buyers. Chapter 3. Subscription Box Services, Curate and Conquer Subscription boxes have become incredibly popular in recent years. From beauty products to snacks, there's a box for everything. The key to a successful subscription box business is finding a niche. Think about what you're passionate about and what people are looking for. You don't need a huge investment to start. A website, some marketing, and initial inventory are your main costs. Partnering with small businesses can help you get products at a lower cost. The global subscription box market was valued at $18.8 billion in 2020 and is expected to grow significantly. Providing a personalized experience is crucial. Customers love discovering new products tailored to their interests. The subscription box model is all about curation, says Emily Johnson in the subscription box handbook. By carefully selecting items that delight your customers, you can build a loyal following. Chapter 4. Sustainable Fashion – Eco-Friendly Apparel on a Budget Sustainable fashion is more than a trend, it's a movement. People are becoming more conscious of the environmental impact of their clothing choices. Starting a sustainable fashion business doesn't require a huge budget. You can begin by upcycling old clothes or using eco-friendly materials. Social media is a powerful tool for promoting your brand. Share your story and the benefits of sustainable fashion. 
A 2022 study found that 67% of consumers consider the environmental impact of their clothing purchases. This shift in consumer behavior opens up new opportunities for eco-friendly brands. Collaborating with influencers can boost your brand's visibility. Sustainable fashion is not just about the products, but also about the message. Sustainable fashion is about making choices that are good for the planet and good for people, writes Lisa Brown in Green Threads, The Rise of Eco-Fashion. It's about creating a positive impact through thoughtful design and production. Chapter 5. Mobile Car Wash convenience on wheels. Mobile car washes are becoming a popular business model. People love the convenience of having their cars cleaned at home or at work. Starting a mobile car wash requires a small investment in equipment and supplies. You'll need a pressure washer, cleaning solutions, and a water tank. The flexibility of a mobile car wash allows you to set your own schedule. You can start part-time and grow your business gradually. The U.S. car wash industry was valued at $14.21 billion in 2021, with mobile services seeing significant growth. Marketing is key to getting your first clients. Use social media to showcase your services and happy customers. Word of mouth can quickly spread in local communities. Mobile car washes offer a unique convenience that traditional car washes can't match, writes Mark Anderson in The Modern Entrepreneur. It's all about providing a service that saves people time and effort. Chapter 6. Digital Nomad Consulting, Guiding the Remote Workforce The digital nomad lifestyle is on the rise. More people are choosing to work remotely while traveling the world. This creates a demand for consulting services tailored to digital nomads. You can offer advice on finding remote jobs, managing finances, and staying productive on the road. You don't need a large investment to start. A laptop and an internet connection are your main tools. According to a 2023 report, there are over 35 million digital nomads globally, and this number is expected to grow. Networking is crucial in this business. Join digital nomad communities and offer free webinars to showcase your expertise. Building trust with your audience will lead to paying clients. The rise of the digital nomad is reshaping how we think about work and travel, says Sarah Parker in Remote Work Revolution. It's an opportunity for entrepreneurs to provide valuable guidance to this growing group. Chapter 7. AI-Powered Chatbots, Revolutionizing Customer Service AI-powered chatbots are transforming customer service. They can handle inquiries 24-7, providing quick and accurate responses. Starting a chatbot development business requires knowledge of AI and programming. However, there are many platforms that make it easier for beginners to create chatbots. The investment is relatively low, mostly involving time and training. The global chatbot market is projected to reach $9.4 billion by 2024. Businesses are increasingly adopting chatbots to improve customer service and reduce costs. Offering tailored solutions for small businesses can be a niche market. Many small businesses want to enhance their customer service but lack the resources for large-scale AI systems. Chatbots are not just a trend. They are becoming a staple in customer service, writes John Smith in AI in Business. They offer a way to provide consistent, high-quality service without breaking the bank. Chapter 8. Personalized Nutrition Plans – The Next Big Thing in Health Personalized nutrition is revolutionizing the health industry. People are looking for diets tailored to their unique needs. Starting a personalized nutrition business involves creating customized meal plans and offering dietary advice. You don't need to be a nutritionist to start. Partnering with certified professionals can add credibility to your service. The global personalized nutrition market was valued at $8.2 billion in 2021 and is expected to grow rapidly. Using technology to analyze clients' dietary habits and health data can set you apart. Apps and online tools can make the process more efficient. Personalized nutrition is about understanding that one size does not fit all writes Emma White in The Future of Food. It's about providing tailored advice that meets individual health needs. Marketing your service through social media and wellness blogs can attract health-conscious clients. Hosting webinars and offering free resources can also build your brand. The key is to provide value and establish trust with your audience. Chapter 9. Tiny Homes – Affordable Living Solutions with Big Profits Tiny homes are becoming a big trend. 
These small, efficient living spaces appeal to those seeking a simpler, more affordable lifestyle. Starting a tiny home business doesn't require huge investments. You can begin by building one or two tiny homes to showcase. The key to success in this market is customization. Offer unique designs that cater to different needs and preferences. The tiny home market is expected to reach $5.8 billion by 2027. This shows a growing demand for affordable and sustainable living solutions. Building relationships with suppliers can help reduce costs. Use social media to share your projects and attract potential buyers. Tiny homes represent a shift towards minimalism and sustainability, says Linda Brown in Living Small, the tiny home movement. They offer a way to live comfortably without the burden of high costs and excess space. Chapter 10. Online Learning Platforms capitalize on the e-learning boom e-learning is booming more people are looking to learn new skills online starting an online learning platform can be a lucrative business you can offer courses in areas you're knowledgeable about or partner with experts the investment is mainly in building a user-friendly website and marketing your courses the global e-learning market is projected to reach 375 billion dollars by 2026 this growth is driven by the increasing demand for flexible learning options. Creating high-quality content is crucial. Use videos, quizzes, and interactive materials to engage learners. E-learning offers a flexible and accessible way to gain new skills, writes David Lee in The Future of Education. It's about providing valuable content that meets the needs of today's learners. Offering free courses or trials can attract users to your platform. Once they see the value, they're more likely to pay for advanced courses. The key is to build a strong reputation through quality and consistency. Chapter 11. Freelance Marketplaces – Connecting Talent with Opportunity The gig economy is growing. Freelance marketplaces are a great way to connect talent with opportunities. Starting a freelance marketplace involves creating a platform where freelancers can offer their services and clients can hire them. You don't need a huge investment to start. A well-designed website and effective marketing are essential. The freelance economy was valued at $1.2 trillion in the US alone in 2020. This shows the vast potential of this market. Focusing on a niche can set you apart. Whether it's writing, graphic design, or tech services, targeting a specific market can help you attract the right users. Freelance marketplaces are all about connecting the right talent with the right opportunities, says Jack Thompson in The Gig Economy, a new workforce. It's about creating a platform that makes this connection seamless and efficient. Building trust is crucial. Implementing a rating and review system can help ensure quality. Providing excellent customer support can also make your platform more attractive to both freelancers and clients. Chapter 12. Smart Home Installation Services, Enter the Home Automation Era Smart homes are the future. More people are looking to automate their homes for convenience and energy efficiency. Starting a smart home installation service can be a high-return business. You'll need to invest in training and the right tools. The market for smart home devices is expected to reach $174 billion by 2025. This growth is driven by the increasing adoption of smart technologies. Offering installation services for devices like smart thermostats, security systems, and lighting can tap into this market. Partnering with smart device manufacturers can help you stay updated on the latest technologies. Using social media and local advertising can attract customers. Smart homes are about creating a connected, efficient living environment, writes Tom Harris in Home Automation, The Next Frontier. It's about offering solutions that make everyday life easier and more efficient. Providing excellent customer service can lead to repeat business and referrals. Educating your clients on how to use their new devices can also set you apart. The key is to stay updated on the latest trends and continuously improve your services.